Hey guys, it is Freshly Squeezed Gaming here. Today I'm going to be doing another Juicy Cast discussion. So, as you can see on the screen, this this video is going to be about YouTube, and I'm going to talk about YouTube, and my opinions on it, and what's wrong with it, and everything on that. But um, a few things before I get into that topic. I just, just things that have been going on lately. Um. First of all, it's kind of random, but Pokemon Go is partnering with Starbucks. I think this is completely random. I don't know what they're going to do with Starbucks. I have a feeling it's going to be like Pokemon Go does something special with like the Starbucks locations. Like maybe puts a special Pokemon at each of the Starbucks. I don't know what they're going to do but with um, Starbucks and Pokemon Go, but yeah. <laughs> I'm really not sure, and also Pokemon Go got a new update. Um, I don't really play Pokemon Go, but I don't. But um, yeah, there's an update where they're adding more Pokemon. So yeah, that's something. And then the other thing I wanted to mention is um, there was a Jimmy Fallon like a week ago. I know it was like a week, but still, Jimmy Fallon was playing the Nintendo Switch and Super Mario Run, which by the way comes out tomorrow, and. I will be making a video on Super Mario Run. But anyway, Jimmy played both of those games, and there wasn't really much to reveal about the Switch that we didn't already know. But Breath of the Wild, we saw some of the scenes with um, Jimmy um, and Reggie playing with it. So we saw some things, like the boulder, and then he ran over and fought the people. They didn't show much, but yeah, I guess. They, they showed a little bit, but yeah, I just wanted to mention that. And Super Mario Run, by the way, it looks pretty good. It's like your um, ordinary Mario game. So yeah, that's my um, opinions on all that stuff. So, let's get into this topic on YouTube. So, let's start with YouTube Heroes. I think this is really stupid and a waste of YouTube's money if they even are contributing any money to this book. As you can see, it says YouTube Heroes is a program designed to recognize and reward the global community of volunteer contributors. The volunteers help create the best possible YouTube experience for everyone by flagging inappropriate videos, adding captions and subtitles to videos, sharing their knowledge with other users. Now, that's ridiculous. Let's, let's just get straight to it. It's ridiculous. I don't know why they need to create a whole other program just to recognize people that are doing these simple things that a lot of other people do. So I don't really get it. I don't know if that's something wrong with my point. But yeah, you can become a hero. I'm not, like nobody's going to use this. Maybe some people, but yeah, I, I haven't really heard of from anybody that's going to use this, so I think it's kind of pointless. So, as you can see, here is the next thing I'm going to be talking about, YouTube Red. Now, I know this has gotten a lot of hate, but I I like it, but I don't like it. Here's what I do like about, about it. I like that these big YouTube these big YouTubers get to create their own content and movie style. Like, I think that's awesome. With movies, it's mainly um, focused on movies, as you can see. But basically, yeah, because YouTubers, you know, they make videos, but here's their chance to make some movies for us to see. And I think, I think it's a brilliant idea. But the part I don't like about it is that you have to pay. Well, I know they want to make money, and YouTube does, and the people want to make money. But yeah, as you can see, you get a one month free trial. And yeah, I know that's good, but ten bucks a month—that's that's a lot. <laughs> that's a lot. Um, but yeah, um, this is my opinions on YouTube Red. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to be talking about is hate on YouTube. Right now, at this moment, there's so much hate on YouTube. Like, it's kind of getting out of hand how much hate there is on YouTube. Like, I see a ton of comments, like, hating on these people. But, the, you could, you, it's not okay to hate no matter what. 
like it's pretty much pointless because it's just putting a target on your back and then people won't like you but like it doesn't really matter what you think when it comes to hate it really doesn't and yet it's okay to uh, comment like criticism constructive criticism that, that's good but saying like I don't like you you're dumb and stuff like that something like that it's just pointless but something like I think you could improve on yeah just blah 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 just something like that and then you say something that they can improve on and then they could take that and put it into the next video so that's that's what's okay so it's just really out of hand and YouTube's been doing a lot about this I talked about in, um, another GC cast I um, talked about cyberbullying and that that was a lot about this, so I'm not going to get in depth with side of bullying because you can go see that video. So yeah, that's basically it with hate on YouTube. So, the next thing I'm going to be talking about is the idea of YouTube and the history of YouTube. Not much history, but as you can see, I'll be scrolling through this so you can see and you can pause it and read it. I'm not going to be focusing on this. I'm going to be focusing on the idea of YouTube. Now, Chad Hurley, Steve Chen, and Jawed Curran, those three guys created YouTube. Now, I think, and most of everybody thinks that YouTube was a genius idea. Like, seriously, like, I don't know how we couldn't come up with this concept earlier. It's, it's genius, but, like, I don't... I don't know, I have mixed feelings about it, I really do, like, um, I just think it's a brilliant idea, YouTube, where people could post videos and content, and the whole world can see the videos that they post. I think it's a brilliant, but not brilliant idea, because it's such a basic idea that we haven't done yet in the world, and it's 11 years old now, YouTube, it's crazy, but yeah. YouTube has come a long way, and that brings me to my last topic. So, the most controversial thing on the internet right now is the idea of YouTube is dead. Now, I know this picture is kind of dumb because we all obviously know YouTube is going to make it to next year, and it says 2016. It's, it's just a picture, but, um, yeah. There's YouTube, YouTube messed up big time, like seriously. Oh my gosh, I can't even begin to explain how many YouTubers are not getting notified from their subscribers. Like, I know I check my subscription box, but I know a lot of people don't, so they're not seeing um, their subscribers' videos in their recommended section, and just, it, they're changing all the algorithms and seeing new things like, the upload button is not upload, it's like this plus button with a line under it, that's very small uh, detail, but still, things like that, they're just changing everything, and they change the notification system, like I just said. Like, um, the videos pop up when you notify them, and this is a really big thing, because you need, guys, I want to I wanna encourage you. YouTubers, you really like, you need to press that bell for them. You need to. Like, it's a big deal. YouTubers are, like, talking about quitting because they're not making enough money and getting that ad revenue because people aren't seeing the videos. It's it's just such a bad idea. It's it's kind of affected me. I see, I've seen earlier, my earlier videos have gotten, like, 30 to 40 views and my videos now have gotten like 10 or something like that, but some of my videos, like my Papa Sushri and stuff like that, that's news, gets a lot of views, but anyway, yeah, that's basically my discussion with YouTube, yeah, I think, I think they're dying, but they're not dying, they're dying, not, not dying as in like people are going away, some people are going away because of this, small YouTubers, not big ones like PewDiePie and Markiplier and all of them and Van Oss Gaming and yeah, people like that. They're not going away. They're just a lot of people 
they're just really struggling and they're and they're they're contemplating on going away so you need to do that in order to save youtube this bell is going to save youtube it's gonna it's gonna depend if youtube dies or it lives another year so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this juicy cast and yeah see you guys next time for another video bye